do a little demonstration uh, with a little less traffic showing when there's no destination set in this current build um, when autopilot's available to engage it will engage uh, and it, it'll navigate um, where it's going is a little bit of a question uh, I spoke to Tesla via email about the intent of city streets when there's no destination uh, and I believe the quote was that's the existential question is where are you going when you have no destination and I believe they said the best predicted path is what it's doing um, so here for a drive just in a little uh, suburban neighborhood with uh, no line designations you can see its intent is still the, the blue line uh, but occasionally uh, and I'll see if I can get it to show this on this demonstration it will make turns um, which is interesting navigating carefully around a yard service truck if you can see this these yard uh, disposal things are identified by green dots so we've got a pedestrian with two dogs bit of stop and go there the pedestrian coming up on the left and two pedestrians on either side of the road sure if there's enough room to get around that cement truck we'll see if it tries I'm guessing it won't it is near closing the windows all right I disengaged it it did not like that a little bit too fast Now the interesting thing that's coming up here is I have no destination and we're coming up on a stop sign intersection. So the question would be which way is the car going to choose to go? And it put on the right blinker. Not sure why it chose right over left. But that's what it's going, where it's going. 
and it did a nice uh, stop turn there. Not sure why I chose to go right though. Alright, we're coming up on a, a biker on the left and another pedestrian with a dog on the right. And a pedestrian crossing the road ahead of me. It's being cautious. The speed about 15 to 20. Good. another stop sign up here which way is it gonna go I'll see if I can get it to change its mind if it wants to go one direction I'll see if I can change it with the blinker I don't believe it will but let's see what happens Okay, so it's going to the right and the curve is to the right, but I'm going to put on the left blinker. So the left blinker is on, but it's got a predicted path to the right. And that's going to go to the right. So the blinker does not impact the current uh, intent of the direction that the car uh, is going when there's no destination set. Here we have another stop sign. It's got the right blinker on. I'm going to put the left blinker on, but it's still showing its path to the right. Did a good job at that stop sign with a nice slow creep. So while I agree the car doesn't necessarily have anywhere to go, I would prefer that the turn signal uh, be a little bit of control over where it was going because I think it could be useful. Here it's, I'm going to put the blinker on as we cross this intersection and you see it, it's not going to take a turn there. So the blinker um, does not have any sort of control. Alright, straight ahead is a stoplight and some railroad tracks. So uh, still with no navigation destination, let's see which direction it's going to go. Looks like it's going to go left. And it did stop with my tires on the railroad tracks. Don't really like that. Alright, we've got a green light and it's going left. Just as if it was going somewhere. exactly sure where it's going. My guess is there's just some sort of a prediction algorithm and, and when given a 50-50 it perhaps chooses the easiest path or, or, or something like that. Um, but I guess we'll watch as each software uh, revision gets updated to see how this changes over time. <laughs> 